Now what we're going to do is I am going to demonstrate our fresh catch, okay? And um, uh, what we're doing this month is we're taking some red snapper, okay? And we flayed out some red snapper, trimmed it, cleaned it up, okay? And I'm going to demonstrate kind of a traditional um, sauce that's going with it. It's a it's a piccata sauce, basically with um, uh, capers and uh, lemon juice and butter. Uh, but what I'm going to do is is I'm going to add some uh, tomato concasse with that. Okay, with the sauce. All right. I'm going to start this out in a saute pan. All right. So we'll get a saute pan going here, hot with some olive oil. I have um, some seasoned flour here, okay? So we'll take our snapper filet here, okay? And we're gonna just dredge it a little bit with, kind of lightly with some seasoned flour, okay? So, all right. And we'll shake a little bit of this flour off, and we should hear a sizzle. So we do hear a little bit of a sizzle here. It's about ready to go. Okay, we have some olive oil here, like I said, in a hot pan. And we'll get that going just like that. So what we want to do is we want to take this and saute this up, or start frying this up in the pan like this to get it cooked and browned on one side. Okay. okay. And by putting a little bit of flour in this, um, or putting a little bit of flour on this um, fillet, the snapper fillet. It helps also thicken up the sauce a little bit. Um, at this point in time, after I flip it, okay, um, I'm going to put some fresh garlic in here, okay, and some shallot. Once I do that, put in some white wine here, okay, and at this point in time, I put in our capers. So when this gets to this point here, we have to put in some lemon juice in here. So, because it is a, a, a lemon caper butter sauce, okay? And we'll just take this and just let that simmer. So when this gets down to a point where it's almost au sec, this is where I like to add in the tomato concasse because if you cook it at first, then it just, it'll just really just turn into mush. Okay, so at this point, our red snapper is done here. Okay, so I'm gonna pull this, pull our fish out here and see, now you can see how this sauce is kind of already thickened up by reducing down to almost au sec, okay? okay? So I'm gonna put that over here to rest. And then now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add in um, a couple cubes of butter. You have to be careful about the heat. You kinda almost wanna really take it off the heat and then just swirl your um, butter in so that it doesn't break because you really don't want this sauce to break when you put it on your fish. So you really want it kind of a, a nice thick sauce, buttery thick sauce like so. So I'm just going to put it right here on our plate like this, and that's a nice filet. It's about approximately about seven ounces or so. And now what we're gonna do is, is we're gonna just take our, our sauce, basically and it's just gonna be smothered right over the top of our fish, like so. It will be served with choice of starch and vegetables, okay? So this is our fresh catch for the month of October. It's a sauteed red snapper with a piccata sauce and tomato concasse.